All right, what's going on, everybody? We got another self coaching video today. I believe this is episode eight. But right now, we are diamond two, div two. I'm gonna try to break into diamond three. I'm gonna end up being like stuck in champion one by the end of the season. I'm definitely gonna be grand champion two by the end of the season for sure. Maybe by even like in two more weeks. But let's go ahead and hop into the ones game, see what we can learn, and see how we can improve. All right, we're in the first game here. I've been playing a lot of ones lately, but hopefully we can uh, get back into the mindset. They're mostly playing twos. So hopefully we can readjust pretty quickly. One's been kind of rough since I haven't been really playing as much, but I think we can get back into it pretty fast. That was a pretty good flick then, huh? You scored it off a low boost. That was... That just proves like you don't need boost most of the time. You need good position. To be fair, he could have challenged me. Because he knew I was low boost and I can't really do much. I had to get the perfect flick there. My fake challenge here. Nice. I don't know why I did that, but he might end up scoring because of my lack of control. No, I'm fine. I'm going for a dribble play here or air dribble. Alright, just get it right over top of him. With the regular, regular flick. Nothing special. Just looked at his car while I was dribbling, which, will, which took me a lot of time actually to do. To get comfortable. I just had to look at my car and flick. But now, since I'm able to uh, look at their car and be able to flick, it's a lot easier. Went for his boost, cause the ball's coming to this direction anyway, so may as well, may as well go for it, right? All right here, I should take this mid boost and my boost. It's kind of greedy, but I don't need the challenge in my corner. Tree, don't panic here. Try to fit to that ball with the nose of my car to the best of my ability. Take my boost again, just to make sure he's low. I'm waiting for him to challenge here. Good challenge from, I think, I'll, I'll try to get a flick over top of him, but uh, it was kind of too late. Uh, we almost scored there, but I think it was the right play. I think, my, I think we waited just a little bit too long. See how he's angling his car, you can kind of tell that he's a, uh, that he, what play he was gonna go for. Go for edge over here. Nice shot. I go for a demo. It's risky. I'm gonna stay here. I'm still in the play here. I'll take it to this mid boot. I'm gonna fake it. Nice, nice demo. I should be back though. Unlucky miss. I think you're gonna play more aggressive. Yeah. I don't know. I just felt like I felt like there he just wanted to score, so I just kind of just predicted that he would turn there. Cause that whole time he was trying to score, he wasn't able to pull it off. So I think he was just doing a little bit aggro there. Media kickoff, try to hit it like dead center. Gonna have more consistent uh, kickoffs. Double jump works a lot. I just ended up double jumping as soon as he was gonna challenge, so it worked out in the best way possible. I have no boost. I'm about to challenge this. I'll go for mid boost, I think. Need pads. I miss like a lot of pads there. Uh, 
can't challenge you. Here I could if I wanted to. Drift here. Watch out for the demo. I'm not going for this. Stay close, make them panic. Nice side. I didn't think he would that was scorable. Yeah, I shouldn't hit it to the wall there. I did end up just passing it to him. Oh, I thought I'd be using like the small pads to try and like not miss the goal. I'm missing too many open nets. I don't even know why. I don't even know like how how's it possible. Oh, he didn't go. Nice. I thought he would have went. Nice. Messed up my flip there. Nice shot. I don't think he would have saved it either way though. I'll call us unfortunate. I don't think we really did any, anything wrong. Might have just got a bad touch. But it wasn't like dead center. Oh, that's backboard. That is. That's not backboard. No, that is sad. No, that's the first game. It's a pretty good first game. Up in the game two, hopefully you can learn something. Alright, we're in the game. Try to pass it to myself off the sidewall. For a bounceable player. Nice. Seen him turn there before coming to a challenge, so I just went for a flick. Or a quick flick, rather. Taking the boost. Ah, uh, couldn't get the touch I wanted for the edge level. He has no boost, by the way. Oh, I wanted to pinch there, but it's fine. Gotta remember he has no boost. I control everything right now. Uh, I wanted to go for a goal there. I saw him go for the mid boost, but I didn't, I didn't have any boost to do it. Not a goal, right? Not a goal. Nice. That's what's up. Ended up getting a good, a good recovery. So it ended up working out. Coming here. Go to end up being a free ball. Then right here, go for a simple, simple side. He's not in a good position to save. Make it hard for him. Made it very awkward for him because he went back while expecting that uh, like a fast out here. So I just took my time. And then uh, I knew he was going to probably come down and then put him in a very awkward spot. I'm actually happy for myself that it played out like that because that's kind of what I imagined. Really exactly what I imagine. 
except for him turning around and kind of killing. Nice. Oh, drift here. Able to recover better. We just go for a regular, a regular regular dribble. Another thing that happens sometimes with this controller, like I, sometimes it presses Y, like it changes my camera when I don't want it to. It doesn't really hurt me at any time, really. It's never doing a critical moment. It's always doing like some weird time. I've been playing a lot of twos, but I feel like it like made me more confident. Oh, it's 4-0. Oh my gosh. I want to get like a, a fair matchup so I can get a good replay. But I might save this one because I think this is a good one here. So. Even though there's a, a lot of goals. Still think it's a, a pretty good one. But there's, there's some things I can learn from this one. I like, I just plan, I know something's off. I think a lot of my mistakes right now are, are mindsets. There are mechanical mistakes for sure, but. I know a lot of mindset mistakes I have to fix, like uh, things like I do too often. Ah, I tried, I tried to do the wall dash. Still spin. But I think the this I've been practicing like uh, making sure I'm holding drift, not land, and it helps out a whole lot with the recoveries. Like I don't know. I think you try to hold it every time you land. You you learn like when you when you shouldn't hold it and when you shouldn't hold it. And the time that you learn when to hold it, it, it helps out a lot. You don't really notice it, notice it, but if you really like go in depth about it, it makes a big difference. It's a simple thing that makes it like a big change, which is pretty cool. Thinking about getting in a six man, not really soon, but I have to get like very comfortable with my uh, own playstyle. Or just get comfortable with my, my decision making. Challenge here. I don't have any boosts if I don't challenge. And I, and I was way too close to the ball. One other thing, I played free play for like a week straight. That help out a ton as well. Nice. That was a cool little second game. Um, might have been watching that one to like four goals, I think. But that's how much of the third one is here. go. All right, we're in the third game here. I'm not sure if it's the same person. I don't think it is, but let's see. Let's see what happens. See what we can do. Nice. I wanted to bait him to kind of go for that boost so I can grab this mid. I can't save this. I'm too early.
I'm gonna call out my fake challenges because I'm not gonna challenge a lot of these. Unless it looks good. If it doesn't look good, then I'm not challenging it. Oh man. I don't know how I messed up that reset. I was, I was kind of free. Reset though, but it's fine. But a nice school from his uh, miss. That fast. My challenge is I was something earlier, but I wasn't comfortable doing this, so I just didn't. Or some into an uncomfortable, uh, uncomfortable, like, touch on the ball for him. They can go for what he's not looking for. Never challenge in corners. Like, never, 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 never. Never challenge in your opponent's corner. There's it's no need to fake challenge it every time. Every time, unless it's like free, but I would just fake challenge it every time. It's not worth challenging it. Oh, nice flick! I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting him to give me a ball, honestly. Oh, I got the boost. Any on goal? No, he didn't on goal. See how I put this in there because I knew you uh you kinda know how they're gonna like um hit the ball here, right? Cause to the left of it, then they're gonna hit it to this direction. So I I meet him there before like uh, instead of following him, I meet him at his point at his point of interest. That made I hope that made sense. I don't know uh, really how to explain it, but I hope I hope that made sense. Like I meet him at B, so he's trying to go to he's trying to go to uh like he's trying to make it to Y, like on the alphabet wise. I want to meet him at X. I'll be on my way to X and then meet him to Y by the time he's there, right? So I'm kind of one step ahead of him. I'm not falling too far behind him. I don't know. I always zone out <laughs> during these uh, it's like self coaching videos. I don't know how to score. <laughs> I went from 6 to 2. Oh, what did I do wrong? I want to watch this. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I double jump. Might have done everything right, but it might have been a perfect shot, but I don't know. I think I might have uh, like went over the goal before. I think I should have turned in a tiny bit more, or try to try to face the ball. Oh, that helped me a lot too, facing the ball, facing the direction of the ball before you uh, jump.
可以。I'm really liking this new playstyle. Oh, it's great size. I just need to figure out how to coach this playstyle. And I'll be set. Hope I don't have to change it for another something like a late SSO or I don't know, like I don't know, I guess Top 100. I just realized. It's, uh, Seven to five. It's a two gold difference. Oh, I'll try to get a demo there. Good patience. Mm -hmm. Always challenge when it just directly in front of the bar like that. Sure, it's always a free challenge. Kind of baited him into a uh, to a challenge. Saw him, saw him commit for it. So it's a free, a free flick. Probably gonna watch the second one. There aren't, there aren't too many good ones. Probably just watch the second one and see what I can learn from that one. But I uh, hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned something, and I'll see you next time.